Get to know phthalates, chemicals called dangerous for children and pregnant women. The word phthalates may still sound foreign to the ear. However, did you know? Phthalates can be found in many products that we use on a daily basis. Exposure to this material is said to have adverse effects on health, especially in children and pregnant women. Phthalates are chemicals used to make plastics strong and flexible. Apart from plastics, phthalates can also be found in soap, shampoo, nail polish, perfume, detergents, skin care products and hairspray. In fact, phthalates can also be found in foods whose packaging contains this ingredient. Dangers of phthalates in children and pregnant women. Apart from eating foods that have been exposed to phthalates, these substances can enter the body through the absorption of skin care products that contain phthalates. Inhaling perfume, nail polish, or house paint, or dust from vinyl products and building materials that contain phthalates also has the potential to allow these substances to enter the body. In pregnant women, phthalates that enter the body can cross the placenta and interfere with the fetus. This material can also be mixed with breast milk, so it can enter the baby's body. In addition, phthalates can also enter a child's body when he sucks on a tither or puts a plastic toy in his mouth. Seeing the large number of products that contain phthalates and the ease with which these substances enter the body, the dangers of phthalates need to be paid attention to, especially for children and pregnant women. Here are the dangers of phthalates in children and pregnant women that you need to be aware of. 1. Motor Disturbances A study shows that pregnant women who are exposed to phthalates tend to give birth to children who have problems with brain growth and development. Usually this will be seen in delays in the development of motor skills and speech. 2. Endocrine System Disorders the endocrine system consists of glands which are responsible for almost all processes in the body. Well, exposure to phthalates is known to interfere with the work of this endocrine system. In the fetus, phthalates increase the risk of abnormalities in the genital organs. Meanwhile, phthalates lodged in a child's body can trigger early puberty, impaired metabolism and organ function, and impaired growth as well as increasing the risk of developing allergies. 3. Miscarriage During pregnancy, pregnant women need to maintain their nutritional intake and avoid exposure to chemicals that can have an adverse effect on the health of the fetus, one of which is phthalates. Research has shown that pregnant women who are exposed to large amounts of phthalates have a 60% higher chance of having a miscarriage compared to women who are not exposed. 4 gestational diabetes. In a study stated that exposure to high amounts of phthalates can trigger weight gain during pregnancy. Meanwhile, moderate exposure to phthalates can make pregnant women seven times more at risk of experiencing impaired glucose tolerance. Excessive weight gain and impaired glucose tolerance during pregnancy are risk factors for gestational diabetes. In addition, about 50% of women with gestational diabetes will be at risk of developing type 2 diabetes after giving birth. Preventing phthalates exposure in children and pregnant women. Phthalates are difficult to avoid. However, there are several ways you can reduce your exposure to too much phthalates. Here's how. Limit the use of plastic for food and drinks. Switch to glass ceramic, wood, or metal-based containers. This step can also be done to reduce plastic waste. Limit buying food that is not packaged using plastic, canned food, or other processed food. Better yet, consume freshly cooked food with good quality cooking ingredients. 
Do not heat food or drinks using plastic. Choose skin care products that do not contain fragrance, be it lotion, powder, shampoo, soap or detergent. Choose baby bottles, tithers, or baby toys that are labeled free of phthalates. Choose a bottled water that has the symbol 1, 2, 4, or 5 below the bottle. Invite children to wash their hands frequently with water and soap, especially after playing. Make sure every room in the house has ventilation so that air circulation can circulate properly. Routinely clean household equipment, including carpets and windows, which may be a place for precipitating phthalates. To protect the people around you from the dangers of phthalates, especially pregnant women and children, try applying the methods above. Don't forget to always eat healthy food. That way, the health of pregnant women and their fetuses can be maintained and the growth and development of children can also be more optimal. In addition, don't forget to routinely check the conditions of pregnancy and child development to the obstetrician and pediatrician. With routine examinations, abnormalities that occur due to the dangers of phthalates can be found earlier and handled better.